Hello, all you wonderful people, and welcome back to the longest episode of the OHKO playthrough. 100% playthrough, yeah, because in 100% we have some missions to do, some side missions like rampages. So, this episode, guys, is about rampages. And you might say, hey, but Infos, are you so dumb? Why did you change an ambulance to a flip stalker, the worst car in the game? Well, guys. I'm doing rampages, and in the rampages, for this specific one, I have to get a tow vehicle to jump to a roof, and after I jump in onto the roof, I have to stand on my tires and not flip over, because if I do complete the challenge, the, the rampage, I have to jump down afterwards, right? Well, yeah, I do. But before that, let's start this one. Let's give attempt, give an attempt to this one, which is the worst one in the game. It took the longest to accomplish, but but if I do this second time ever in my life, if I do this again, this playthrough, I know what to do and I know how to finish it, how to pass it very quickly. And also in the first attempt, as you can see, I did quite a few deaths, kills. This is the best way of do uh, one of the best ways of doing it, by the way, from this location, because nobody can see you, nobody can touch you. And maybe, I didn't think about this, but a YouTube comment told me that maybe I should change my camera angle to top down. If I do that, I can see through the wall, I haven't tested it, but... I guess you can try it out, just press C, I think it's C in this game, and you can see over the wall. <laughs> Not sure if they're gonna respawn if I do that. Like if you're looking at something, they're not gonna spawn at that particular spot. So if you look top down, you can see the whole part over the wall, so I'm not sure if they're gonna spawn, but uh, you can feel free to test it out. But I had so much trouble, guys, with this one. It took me forever. You're gonna see so many fails in this video, too. Oh, boy. Lots of attempts on lots of different rampages are gonna happen today, guys. This is why this episode is so huge. We have one more episode, actually, after this. So... That's awesome. As you can see, seven more people, guys. Seven. I, I got so close. I got so close to the end. Six people. I could have had it on my first attempt, but no, it took forever. And I decided to show it a whole first attempt. I did skip a bunch of attempts because I had too many guys on this particular one. I did skip a bunch, but I showed you the deaths and the fails for each attempt. Just to see that I'm not bamboozling you. Or anything. I'm showing all the deaths. I had lots of deaths guys on this particular one and a few others. But yeah, this episode is about rampages and a few main story missions. We're very close to the end guys. This and the next episode and we're done. So I have to wrap up a few things. Yeah, I had to kill this guy but I had no, <laughs> I had no Uzi. I wanna kill him so I can take this from over here and not do it from here, just take it. Like so, this is very a very dangerous spot by the way because the Colombians spawn and they can shoot me. Oh, I can fit through here, okay, good. Let's go, run, <laughs> run, dude, before he see. Actually, uh, these guys spawn so Colombians don't spawn now, which is great. And my flip stalker disappeared for some reason. And I had to take this. <laughs> I took a flip stalker, man, from so long. And there we go, another flip stalker. Great joy. <laughs> so much joy. So this is why I need a flip stalker. To drop down here. And if I do this, if I do complete the rampage, I am gonna die because I have to drop down. But if I don't complete the rampage, I'll still die, because they'll kill me, <laughs> and yeah, so from here the point is to get the rampage. I have to use 
a shotgun for this one, which is insane to you. Ugh, so let's go. At least they spawned beforehand. Wasted. And I got wait. Of course I got wasted. Of course. This place sucks, but it's the only good place to do it at. Of course I could hide it hide behind bushes or something. I don't know, I maybe should have tested, but no, this is all raw, I'm showing you everything, this is the first attempt of doing lots of this stuff, where are you going dude? Oh yeah, there's one over here too, this one is easy. Just snipe Columbians, you would think that the rampage like this one would cause me no issues, right? You just stand here, nobody can touch you. You can just do your headshots from far away, they can't reach you, they can't shoot you. So you'll be all good. Six people, uh, seven people left. No problemo. Headshot again. I said headshot again. Headshot again. F up, six people left. Five people, four people. Just a few more. And... Good. Could somebody tell me, how did they shoot me? Hmm? How? how? How did they shoot me? Now in this playthrough I have had quite a few dumb deaths because of my fault or because of the game's fault. Now this right here is a justified death. However, even with that said, they shot through the wall, so... I can't give the game too much credit, cause uh, the game robbed me again, kinda, kinda, it was... I Maybe I should have had some more protection. Eh. You, you can judge it by yourselves, was that justified or not? The previous death was justified, this one, not so sure about. But rampages in general are insane in GTA 3 guys, in GTA Vice City 2. They're insane, especially the katana rampage, oh my goodness. Could you imagine there being a bat rampage here? This is a bat mission, which is very funny how I recorded it. <laughs> my attempts on it were very funny, I had so much dread before starting that one. And you'll see why <laughs> in the mission when it started. Before that, enjoy some deaths on the rampages. <laughs> So far you have said, hey, bad infos, you're so smart, you're so good at this game, you have only 20... Uh, is it 9? I'm pretty sure 29 deaths so far. You're so good, you're amazing. Well, wait until I start the rampages, which I already did, and I already... <laughs> it has been like 8 minutes so far, and I have 2 deaths. Just wait for some more. <laughs> it's gonna happen, it's gonna happen. Oh, my health. I mean, my, my money. Look at my money. Pretty cool number. Oh, it's raining on my parade. My parade is soggy. Oh, searching for a flip stalker. Let's go back. Oh no, I'm actually gonna go for the... Yeah, this one, okay. So, the second location for the fire rampage is over here. This is the first time I'm trying this, so... I'm not gonna do it properly, so my plan was to park a car over there, use it as cover, and shoot through this wall. This was not the correct way of doing this rampage. There's a, an ultra easy way from this location to do it. And you guys have to wait for the next episode to see it. I'm pretty sure actually I did it in the next episode. I, I'll do lots of attempts guys on this one until I actually figure out how to pass it and after I try the second way actually there's three ways after I try the third way I pass it on the first attempt first attempt this is dangerous as you can see they can still shoot me and I have to be mobile I have to move I have to watch out and whatnot so I'm showing you this first attempt on this section this location and I'll show you any deaths, of course, any fails. 
in the other attempts, not the whole thing, but here I'm showing the whole thing, because why not, I could have sped this up too, I could have made this episode shorter, but I feel like I, you should see this, you should see this, you should see the first attempt, I believe, ah, back at you, yeah guys, very dangerous, my car explodes too, which could still, you know, cause me some issues, it could explode on my face, <laughs> not very good, but yeah, do, do you want me to spoil how to pass this? You know what? No, I'm not gonna spoil it. But it's it's very... it's not too obvious, but it's kind of obvious what you should do for this one. You just have to watch and find out, suck it. <laughs> ah, we have a few more kills, if only I had one more minute, guys. It, the, the time is too small. <laughs> and my car disappears, so no protection. And Rampage failed. At least I did not die. This is my other attempt, by the way. Another attempt on this location. As you can see, I'm skipping stuff now. Also, one attempt takes me forever. It takes me forever to drive from one place to the other. So, I'm just showing you little snippets of it. And here, yeah, here I had three stars, guys. Three stars. Now, this one took me like two hours. These attempts in this episode, you see, our attempts took me about two hours. You'll see a few minutes of that, but it took me forever, guys. I was so angry. At this particular rampage, I was so angry. I got three stars because I killed too many people next to cop the cars and the cop cars set on fire, they exploded, which killed more people. So yeah, I have 3 stars, in some of these, these attempts I have 3 stars, I can't do anything about it. So I have to come here and go to pen spray before I attempt it again, because if I do attempt it with stars, the cops are gonna spawn and kill me in the rampage, because they do that. It's not like in San Andreas with the... Um, uh, things. Uh, gang territories, because in gang territories uh, the cops don't spawn. But here they do. And he's approaching, and he's shooting, and... And... I got it off. Oh, yeah, of course I did. I failed this one, 7 kills. Or 7 more kills I had to do. This location is the... It's my doom, man. So many deaths here. Like I said... Rampages are insane. From here I can't die, but from this location I can. And I had only one person, guys. One person left here. I could have ended it on this note. But no. One more fail. Die. Then over here nobody was spawning, and this guy spawned behind me, so I couldn't do anything about that. Uh, I'm over it. Yo, Chopper. Cool location for you to spawn, bro. I got really scared, I had still like 10 kills left. And I booked it, I said, ah, oh, screw it, I'm not sticking around. And these Colombians are here, who are gonna shoot me too. Lower my health, and I have 3 stars, so I have to go back. Oh boy. This attempt sucked, and I have... Oh, actually, it's four stars. I thought it was three stars, but no, I have four stars even. How did I manage to do that? Also, sorry I'm not showing you the whole attempt, but... Do you want to see two hours of this? Eh? I'm assuming it's two hours, I don't rem remember, but... Pretty sure it's two. The whole footage of this session is like four hours, maybe five hours. The whole session was that long. Oh, getting two stars. Oh yeah! I got exploded, right? I forgot about this, yeah. Another death. The first death actually in that location. I failed here. So no death, one more fail here. Let's go. Oh yeah, here I had stars. Here I said, ah, I don't need to get rid of my stars. It's only two stars. What's the worst that can happen? Well, the worst spawned behind me, and the worst shot me. <laughs> yeah.
So here I said, okay, I had enough, I'm just gonna go save. I have done this for too long, I'll just save. And my session. Back at my place. And continue a different day because I was so annoyed. Wouldn't you guys be annoyed? The same thing over and over again, I got really annoyed, so I came here, stopped my game and the next day I continued. What do we have here? Bulletproof vehicles, ok, I'll just take this for the future missions because after this I'm gonna take a break from the rampages and actually do some missions. What you doing dude? Gonna take it out? Really? Why? No, <laughs> smarty pants, ok. <laughs> He had a second thought. Okay, whatever. Like I said, yeah, my game is glitching out because I have been playing for like 4-5 hours. <laughs> so yeah, that's it guys, I'm ending here. And I'm continuing the next day because I was annoyed. I usually don't do this in the middle of an episode, but uh, I couldn't make this episode like 15 minutes, right? I could have, but no. This episode is 46 or something, I don't know. This episode is huge. This is the biggest episode. What you doing, Copper? Move it. Like he says, move it. And guys, it's time for some main story missions. Take a break from the deaths. There's so, 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 so many deaths. Oh, so many attempts too. We have more attempts, by the way. We're not done. We didn't actually complete anything. <laughs> We actually did, we did complete the sniper rampage, but the fire rampage? Hell no! We have so much more. Which mission is this? I was not paying attention. Bait? Is this bait? Or espresso to go? I'm pretty sure is this bait. Is it bait? Tell me! Tell me! What the hell is this mission? It says kills. Wise guy. Let's go, wise guy. With my stinger. Good start to an episode. I guess. Should have sped this up. But whatever. It's fine. If I did, this episode would have been shorter, which is what I want. But whatever. Doesn't matter. Some of the previous episodes in the previous. OHKO playthroughs were much longer, I, get a, I think I had 50 minute episodes. Oh yeah, this is bait, okay, cool. This mission is awesome. Yo buddy, <laughs> what's up? So this is a tactic which I have used for 6 years maybe. So what you do is don't stop, just go to one guy, go to the second guy and the third guy, or guys, because there's guys in the cars. Don't stop, don't wait for them, just go through all of these and go to the location in which the mission actually takes place, where you can kill them. Just round them up like cattle, <laughs> like farmyard animals. Because they are animals, yeah, take that. Anyway, you just do this. Go around, pick them up, and lead them to an ambush. In the ambush, we're gonna kill these guys. Or I'm just gonna watch and they're gonna kill them, because I'm a pansy. As you all probably know. Let's go, buddy, come over. We have cookies, we have cake. Is the cake a lie though? Is it a lie? Ton ton ton, it is a lie, it's an ambush. So this is what you do. In OHKO specifically, I recommend not getting out of your vehicle. Usually I don't get out of my vehicle without OHKO, but even with OHKO, especially with OHKO, I recommend not getting out. Because if you do, they will shoot you. They will shoot you still, but in a car. They could hit the car, which is okay. Kinda, it can still catch on fire, but still. Is the car blocking it? Oh, they're shooting at me. Destroy them quick. I'm not getting out. That would be dumb. What? <laughs> Dude, 
What you doing? <laughs> He's stupid. Why'd you get out? <laughs> I guess I got... What the hell are you doing? Just to be safe, I guess, yeah. If I don't stay in the car, they'll get the hell out of here, which is not good. Actually, it is good because I can kill this guy. Who? Why is nobody shooting this guy? What the hell? This never happens. This is so dangerous. Unneeded dangerousness in this mission. This should not have happened. I remember this. Oh, why did this have to happen? Yeah, so... This was scary. So I had to wait here again for these guys to come. Because we have to be in a car for them to be here. For some reason. See? Instant kill! Why didn't you do this before? My guys got stuck, dude. Before. Also, see guys? See? Main story missions don't take any effort. No deaths. How many deaths have I had in main story missions? Not many. Very few. But in rhyme pages? Rhyme pages are the big clutch here. The big issue. The big death death uh, increaser. <laughs> death count increaser. Ooh, sky, beautiful sky. Oh, Stinger, let's go. Oh, Banshee. Yeah, Banshee, not Stinger. The Banshee and the Stinger here look so similar. Where are you going, dude? Oh, yeah, to A. Okay. We have the A mission. I'm pretty sure Donald mission is just a cutscene. Oh, espresso to go. This mission could also get sour, by the way. What, what could happen is you could crash into lots of stalls and it could decrease the health of your vehicle. If it does, it could explode right next to the stall. In the stall, there's people, there's Columbians who are gonna shoot you. If they shoot you, you die, you're dead, you're dead. So, it's a good idea to change vehicles as much as possible. Also, before I, I did this mission, I did not practice, so I did not actually remember exact the exact location for each one. Because I haven't done it in like six years, maybe this mission. I guess not six years, because I did the winter mode playthrough recently. So yeah, I guess not six years. Uh, so yeah, I have, I have some practice. That's why I remembered. It's okay. Let's destroy this dude. And... Bam! Perfect. 3 out of 9. We have 5 here. Is it 5? Yeah, pretty sure it's 5. Yeah, it's 5. This one. One more. I have to change the vehicle here, by the way. Because it's very low health. I have crashed into 4 stalls. And cars and... Buildings and whatnot. So yeah, I have to change it as quick as possible. As soon as possible. As soon as I see a better car, I should change it. This was dangerous, I should not have done this because he could have shot me. He oh, people see, see, see. If he was still after me, he could have killed me. So that was dumb, dude. I, sh I have enough time. Why am I doing this? Why am I putting my life in danger? YOLO, guys. You live once or something. You only live once, yeah. YOLO. But I just don't live once, I live a bunch of times. <laughs> Cause I die a lot. Six. Very good. Die, stupid. He shot me. So for this one, there's a trick you can use. Again, the Mafia territory is crazy. St. Mark's is crazy because the one or two shotguns shots kill you. So it's not good to stay on the road. On the street. So what you do is park your Rico here, right here, climb on top of it, so you can see where you're aiming, and throw a grenade. It's always gonna hit the target. This is perfect. It's what you should do too, even if you're not playing with OHKO. Where are you going, dude? Oof, I got scared. Look at this guy, he tried to go to St. Mark's. What? That was gonna be a huge mistake, bro. Luckily, he's a smarty pants and figured it out that he should not go there. 
and it's time to go to Short Set Veil. Vale. Also guys, we have just a few more missions, a few more main missions and we're done. The problem is the rampages. The rampages could have taken me one attempt. If they took me one attempt, I could have had 12 episodes. But no, they're insane. Like I said, gotta wait, they gotta change the car, and we're just waiting for a different car to spawn. Perfect. <laughs> the taxi crashed. Good job, Cabby. Let's go here. We have one over here and one at the hospital. This is a brand new car, so I can't explode. Of course, I can explode, but it's full health still, so. Before I explode, it's gonna take a while. Also, there's a guy here who spawned who I forgot completely about. This Colombian dude. So I had to <laughs> be kinda careful because if he if he flipped me, he could have stopped right next to me, gotten out, the people who could could have gotten out of it, then shot me. So yeah, uh, maybe I should have uh, watched out for him. But I didn't apparently. Which is fine. Hey, stretch. Stretchy boy. Stupid stretchy boy. I hit you. Two stretchy boys. Did you see the two stretchy boys? Oh, this reminds me I have to take the BF injection to the garage. Oof. Oh, don't tell me you're doing what, what I think you're doing. You're going to a rampage, aren't you? Oh no. Or actually, is he going to the payphone? Oh, rampage! Oh. Big mistake, man. Oh, we're going back at this. I, I's not here even. <laughs> yeah, so I took a little break with main story missions. And I have to go again, guys. I have to start again. Remember, this is the second session, so I'm kind of fresh. I kind of thought about how I should pass these missions. And let's see what plans I have. For this one I had no plans, just the same thing. However, for the second one I have a plan. So let's do it. Do it. As a famous person once said, Mr. Dooku. Actually, was it Dooku? I, I'm not a Star Wars fan, I'm sorry. It's not Dooku, right? It's the Emperor or something? I, I don't know. Oh, the Star Wars fans. Oh. I have anger the Star Wars fans, I'm sorry. Not a Star Wars guy, I don't like the series. Uh oh! Dislike! <laughs> Unsubscribe! Unfollow! <laughs> I'm sorry. But Star Wars is not for me. Oh, more unsubscribes! <laughs> anyway, I failed, I did not die. It's kinda hard to die from this location, but I still died once. <laughs> you saw it. I showed it to you, right? Yeah, I did show it to you. So it's entirely possible to die, but I didn't because I'm not such a pro. So here's my plan for this one, guys. I had so many devs so far, maybe f f seven or something, I don't know how many devs. It's probably not seven, but it, let's say five devs. So here's my plan. I'll take it. Get in my car. Drive. To a different location. Across the street, which has a much longer wall. Stand right here. And from here. Kill the Colombians. Here. I can go through the whole street. And behind me people can spawn, which gives me more room to shoot people at. See? A lot more room. The people behind me spawn and I can shoot them too or fry them or whatever it's called. So much more potential in this area. If I did this on the first attempt, I could have saved maybe five deaths or something. And if I do this in again, again in the future, I will do exactly this. Exactly. And if you're gonna do this, do this. <laughs> do this exact thing. Do you see my time? I still have a minute, guys. A whole minute for two people. This was a piece of cake. I didn't think about this earlier, and I should have, and I didn't. I still have 45 seconds. And... Death. Death. Not for me, for them, 
the hardest mission in the game, completed in a super mega easy way. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so disappointed. <sighs> I'm happy that I thought about it, I'm just not happy that it took me so long to figure it out, <laughs> but... Whatever, I didn't even practice this. I said, okay, let's try something different. Let's get out of here in this of this location because clearly it was not working. It took me forever to to figure that out. It's not working. I was so happy that I went back to Donald. Yeah, Donald time. Okay, Donald. I'm pretty sure has only a cutscene. Is the cutscene? Yeah, it is. Okay, good. Oh, Banshee, nice. Is it time for Sam, guys? Time for Sam. Sam time. Let's see. Pretty sure it's Sam because we have just Sam and the exchange. Is it? Sam, perfect. Okay. So we have this mission, guys. We have the exchange. We have all the pay for missions in Shoreside Vale and Rampages. Oh, I have to take a tank to uh, the import export. Vico emergency crane. Yep, gotta do that. Did I take the enforcer? Did I do that? Not sure. I took it once, but it flipped. <laughs> Did I take it again? Is the question. Yeah, I was checking which weapons I have here because it's a good idea to have a rocket launcher and a sniper, especially because I will shoot from a distance. <laughs> These guys. I'm shooting them so they can fall off. We have a timer, we have to reach the airport. At the airport we have to dispose of these guys and dispose of a plane too. Before the plane, I'll just shoot these guys from a distance, just to be safe. Also in this mission what I could do is just exploit it. I could use replay, replay exploits to get rid of my stars, but no, I'm not doing that. No exploits. I'll just do it raw and I'll collect some bribes, which also works. So expect that. I was checking slowly if I have anybody left. Do we have anybody here? We do not. Or we do. Dun dun dun, we do. Okay, let's stop here. One more. I actually was not sure which uh, runway it is at, it's gonna use, but after I saw these enemies I said, okay, clearly it's gonna be here, ah, oh, swamp water, ew, <laughs> yeah, clear, oh, blood water, <laughs> what the hell, so yeah, clearly they were gonna be here, cause uh, the enemies were here, so I had to watch out here, oh, there we go, watch out, 8 seconds, have to destroy it and collect the crap. This does not damage me by the way. And also I went to pick him up but then I realized hey I have four stars maybe I shouldn't stay on foot and be in the car because the chopper is coming and that can shoot me. So pick it up and go back. This is why I took a very fast car, a very healthy car too. Which I'll use for the way back. Oh, am I gonna take a plane? Oh, dude, I didn't think about it. Okay, I I guess it's a good idea. Yeah, it's a better, a better idea, yeah. Dude, past infos is smart, man. I, I didn't even think about taking a plane right now, but in the video I did. Okay. Damn, dude. He's so smart. <laughs> I'm so proud of him. Past infos. Are you proud of Mr. Past Infos? Or are you proud of future infos? Who's talking to you right now? Let's see how good at uh, <laughs> landing is Mr. Past Infos. Because I could still... I could still land on the street. And my, my plane could um, explode. If it explodes, I have to get out. If it's gonna about... If it's about to explode. I have to get out. If I do, on the street, I could be in trouble, guys. <laughs> the cops could kill me. Oh, bad landing. 
It's semi semi okay landing, I guess. Because it's still inside the, the place. I'll change to this car. Because it's a car. And I can stop right next to the place. It's perfect. And I could finish the mission right here. And guys, like I said, the last main story mission is unlocked. However, I'm not gonna do it. That's gonna be the last thing I do before the tank. So what I'll do is I'll do the exchange last and then the tank. I'll deliver the tank. Because after that mission, the tank is unlocked and I can do that before that mission. However, I'll do everything which is left. And what's left is, like I said, we have a few more rampages. I'm pretty sure it's two rampages left. The shotgun rampage and the M16 headshot rampage. That should be it. And... Lastly, we have a few... Uh, a few uh, payful missions, yep. Payful missions. Oh, the barracks! I gotta take the barracks, right, right, right. So I still haven't completed the emergency vehicle crane. Okay. So, time to travel, guys. Which is fine. Travel time to Portland. Gonna drop this off. Pretty sure I have not dropped the enforcer and the ambulance. I'm pretty sure. Did I drop off the ambulance? Yeah, huge drive, but it has to be done, guys. The problem with this crane is the tank, which I can't get currently. So fat. How can you lift this huge load, bro? Wow. Anyway, pick up a Karuma and go back to Stolten. In Stolten I have to take a few things. Oh, first of all, yeah, first of all the ambulance. As is tradition, guys, I have to flip this vehicle. <laughs> Every single time I have done this, I flipped it. <laughs> Stop flipping, stupid. Okay, time for the ambulance. The first time, for the first time it's unlocked. It took me like three attempts to... I mean, I tried three different times to get it from here. It was locked every single time. <laughs> but it's okay. Let's take it back. The second to last vehicle, if I didn't get the Enforcer... I'm pretty sure I didn't, dude. Because I know it flipped. It flipped in Portland. Oh, the beautiful sky. It, di it did flip in Portland. But did I go back and take it? All the episodes are a blur to me, guys, because I edit episodes, I record episodes, I voice them, and whatnot. It's all a mishmash of stuff, so I'm not sure if I have done certain things, but you guys know. Oh yeah, I haven't. I'm going straight to the Enforcer. Okay. Let's push this out of the way. And I guess afterwards I'm gonna start the pay for missions. Oh boy. Well, actually, before that, in this episode, I'll do some more rampages. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rampage time. Okay. And for... Oh, dude! Oh, did you see what I did? Do you remember how I flipped the Enforcer in Portland? Do you know how I flipped it? I crashed into a fire... Ex fire... Fire thing. Fire... Hydrant? Yeah, hydrant. The hydrant. I crashed into that and I flipped. And I did the same thing here. <laughs> the same exact thing. Am I gonna go save? Or just pick up weapons? Where are you going? Oh yes! Right, right, right! Right, right, right. <laughs> Best infos is smart infos, man. I didn't even think about this. But yeah, I gotta take the BF injection to... Short set veil. And in short set veil I have missions. So this guy is so smart, dude. I have to travel to short side anyway, so why not with this vehicle? <laughs> Which always spawns here at night time, by the way. And I do need it for the last garage. The second garage, the last garage. Okay, let's go. Let's take it to it. I should have taken some weapons from my place. Actually, should I have? Because we just have rampages. In rampages, I get weapons. 
And I do die, so I lose the weapons to lose my weapons. <laughs> so, not the best idea, but this garage is completely done. Let's find the Banshee. Banshee. And let's drive to the payphone, maybe? Or. No, I think I'm gonna do some rampages. Some rampages attempts coming. Like I said, we have two. The headshot rampage for the. Hoots and the the thing, the uh, shotgun rampage for the Hoots. We technically have another rampage for the first payphone mission, which I have to use an Uzi in a car to shoot them, which kind of is a, like a rampage, but it's technically not because it's officially not rampage. It kind of is, but officially it's not. It's hard to explain. Oh, he's not even here. I risked my life for nothing. Pay attention, dummy. So yeah, I did this the previous day, so I didn't remember exactly which one I ended at. Also, hitboxes. Oh, uh, hitboxes in GTA 3. <laughs> they killed me actually in the previous episode. Oh, this was so dangerous. Oh my goodness. Oh, I risked my life for nothing. But I didn't die, guys. I didn't die. And, and my again, the car disappeared. They always disappear at this location for some stupid reason. Whatever. Beautiful moon. Gorgeous. I like you, Claude. You're a gorgeous boy. It's what I've been told. I'm not into boys, so I can't, <laughs> I can't judge. But if you are, let me know if he's a gorgeous boy. Or a gross boy. I guess it's subjective because some people like muscles, but some people hate muscles. Okay, so you know what's gonna happen here, I'll just uh, fail the mission. So I'm speeding up. If I speed up something, it means I'm not gonna do it in that attempt. Just a warning. Yeah, this is not the correct way of doing it. Even this mission, if I had some practice, if I knew what to do beforehand, it could have taken me one attempt. Also, this is dumb what you're doing. Do not do this. Do not. You're risking your life, as they say. See, I'm not doing any headshots. Any headshots from this. However, I know when to quit. Or do I? Just still waiting for guys to spawn. And nobody's spawning, I have 7 kills left. But yeah, nobody's spawning, I have 10 seconds left, so I said, oh, screw it, I'm not gonna risk my life anymore. Let's drive to a different one. So guys, next episode, prepare yourself for all the pay for missions, and the last mission in the game, and the tank uh, drive to Portland. And you know exactly how many times I died. So far, I'm pretty sure it's 35. Is it 35? Pretty sure. Let's make it 36. <laughs> Let's go. This location, I'm not gonna take it from here, not gonna do it from here. Because once I attempted it and I died. So, let's not do that again. What I'll do is I'll get a flip stalker or a tow vehicle and go for the other location. Or am I gonna wait here? Oh, yes, I guess I'm gonna wait for this one. Okay. I'll just speed this up, I guess. Or. I guess I'll shoot a little bit from here. Okay, I guess that's the plan. Shoot a little bit and attempt it from this this location, which is dumb. I shouldn't do this because I don't have much time. Oh boy. You're risking your life, as the cops say. <laughs> Always. Why didn't I speed this up? I guess I'm testing. Oh yeah, 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 this is when I figured it out, guys. This is when I said, hey, you know what? Let's count this. Let's see how many I have. Decrease it this much and see how I do. See, now I can actually aim properly, guys. I can actually aim at the heads. I can actually do headshots. If I did this like five episodes ago, I attempted this one maybe five episodes ago. If I did this back then, I would have... It would have taken me one attempt, but no, it didn't. 
This is the beauty of this series guys, you're watching the first attempt at everything. So let's see, how do you do this one properly guys. This is how, you decrease it and shoot directly at their head. This kills them, you get the kill and it's much 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 easier. Guys, I have a button on my mouse which decreases my sensitivity, which I said it's enough. But no, it was not enough, I couldn't be precise, but now I can be precise. Perfect strategy, which I should have done before, but I didn't, but it's okay. Look at how many kills I got <laughs> so quickly. Dude, I have no idea how people on console do this. How do you guys do this? How, how can you use on this Rampage controllers and actually pass it? See guys, first attempt... Was it 6 or... I, I, that's why I counted to bring it back to normal and I was so happy! Woohoo! So guys, this was it. Let's end the episode on a good note. That was the good note. It was a great ending to a great episode. I hope you enjoyed the longest one so far. In the next one, we're gonna start these missions and finish off the game in the next episode. So guys, thank you so much for watching this one. And a very special thank you to my top channel members and patrons. Otuti Live, Alex Chavez, FZO, Monish Pardeep, Max Robinson, LMP Racing, House the Chowder, SMRJ, Pari Bruce Lane, Sparky, Smokey O, Darren Pimlet, and everyone else on the screen. Thank you so much.